100 divided by 6 here, 6 is a divisor, so we need multiplication table of 6, 6 times 0, 0, 6 times 1, 6, 6 times 2, 12, 6 times 3, 18, 6 times 4, 24, 6 times 5, 30. To find out the multiplication table of 6, just add 6 with the previous step, 0 plus 6, 6, 6 plus 6, 12, 12 plus 6, 18, 18 plus 6, 24, 24 plus 6, 30, 30 plus 6, 36, 36 plus 2, 42, like this. So 6 goes into this one how many times? 0 times as 1 is less than 6. So 0 times 6, 0 times 6, 0. Substract, you are getting 1. Bring down this 0. So you are getting 10. 6 goes into 10 how many times? 2 times 12 which is getter. So 1 times. So 1 times 6, 1 times 6, 6. Subtract, you are getting 4. Bring down this 0. 6 goes into 40 how many times? Look. 7 times 42 which is getter. So 6 times right 6 here 6 times 6 36 again subtract you are getting 4 okay so this is our remainder which is less than 6 so our answer is 16 remainder 4 16 remainder 4 but if you want to write your answer in decimal form then what will happen convert this whole number into decimal number taking decimal then adding any number of zeros so bring down the first zero you are getting 40 so before this zero there is a decimal decimal must come to the question directly 6 goes into 40 how many times again 7 times 42 that is 6 times 6 6 times 6 6 times 6 36 subtract you are getting 4 bring down the next 0 so you are getting 40 6 goes into 40 again 6 times right 36 subtract 4 bring down the next 0 you can add any number of zeros so again 6 goes into 40 6 times 6 times 6 36 subtract 4 that is this process is continuing so you can place here three dot just after decimal i have taken three three digit three places or three digit and then i have places three dot so this is the answer since six is repeating you can write answer like this place bar over six this means this six is repeating 16.6 .6 bar is our answer in decimal form